Hi everyone, my name is Maui Esvergla. I am from BSN1 BN11. And for today's video, I will be teaching you how we will get the mean, median, and mode of a given set of data from the measures of central tendency. So, what are we waiting for? Let's start! And this was a given set of problems, and we need to find each its mean, median, and mode. This is the first set of data, and we need to determine its mean, median, and mode. First, we will determine the mean. For this mean, we are going to use the formula, the formula of summation of x over n. We will add all the values over its number of values. So, 2 plus 7 plus 5 plus 7 plus 14 will be divided by 5 because there are 5 values. And there are 35 over 5. 35 over 5 is equal to 7. Therefore, the mean is 7. Next, we are going to determine the median. And in determining the median, we are going to arrange the value ascending or descending. And I have chose to arrange this ascendingly. This set of data has 5 values. Therefore, it is an odd number. Therefore, we can easily determine the middle value. And this set of data's middle value is 7. Therefore, the median is 7. Next, we are going to determine the mode of the set of data. And in determining the mode of a set, we need to arrange the values ascendingly or descendingly. And I have arranged this set ascendingly. After that, we need to look for the value that is being repeated. And in this set of data, 7 is the only repeated value. Therefore, 7 is the only mode, which tells us that this set of data is unimodal. Now that we've determined the mean, median, and mode for the first problem, let's proceed to the second problem. This is the set of data for the second problem, and we need to determine its mean, median, and mode. Let's determine its mean first. In determining the mean, we need to use the formula which is the summation of x over n. We add all the values over its number of values. So, 8 plus 3 plus 3 plus 17 plus 9 plus 22 plus 19 divided by 7 because there are 7 values of this set of data. 81 over 7 is equal to 11.57. Therefore, the mean of this set of data is 11.57. Next, we are going to look for its median. And again, in looking for the median, we need to arrange the set in ascendingly or descendingly. And I chose to arrange this set ascendingly. This set of data has 7 values and 7 is an odd number and like I've said from the previous problem, we can easily determine the middle value of a set if it is an odd number of set. And in this set, 9 happens to be in the 4th position and therefore it is the middle value. So our median is 9. Next, we are going to determine the mode. And again, in determining the mode, we need to arrange the set ascendingly or descendingly. And I arrange this set ascendingly. After that, we need to look for the value that is being repeated. And in this set, 3 is repeated. And it is the only thing that is repeated. Therefore, the mode for this set is 3. Which tells us that this set of data is unimodal. And now that we've determined the mean, median, and mode of the second problem, let's proceed to the third and last problem. 
This is the set of data for the third problem. We need to determine its mean, median, and mode. So let's determine the mean first. And again, in looking for the value of mean, we need to use the formula of summation of x over n, which is when we add all the values over its number of values. So, 11 plus 8 plus 2 plus 5 plus 17 plus 39 plus 52 plus 42 is equal to 176. So, we need to divide that by 8. We divide that by 8 because there are 8 number of values. 176 divided by 8 is equal to 22. Therefore, the mean for this set of data is 22. Now that we know the mean, we need to look for the median next. And again, in determining the median, we need to arrange the set of data either ascendingly or descendingly. This set of data has 8 values, and 8 is an even number. Unlike an odd number of values in a set, we need to add the two middle values and divide them by 2. The middle values are 11 and 17. 11 plus 17 is equal to 28. And 28 divided by 2 is equal to 14. Therefore, the middle value or the median is 14. Now that we know the mean and median, let's look for the mode. And again, in looking for the mode, we need to arrange the set ascendingly or descendingly. And I arranged this set ascendingly. After it has been arranged, we are going to look for the value that is being repeated. And in this set of data, there are no values repeated which tells us that this set of data has no mode. Now that we've finished looking for the mean, median, and mode of the three sets of data given, I hope you've learned something. This has been Maui's Regla from BSN1 BN11. Thank you for watching and God bless.